Hi guys, welcome back. So in today's video, we're going to install a Burger Motorsports JB4 tuning box on our Mark 8 Golf R. But before we jump into it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, also the notification bell, then you won't miss if our new videos go live. So if you're familiar with our channel already in this build, we've installed a race chip already on the car, which is obviously a tuning box, and it's made some decent power gains. Um, but in my opinion, it doesn't particularly drive too great with it on the car potentially running into like clutch slip issues, maybe some torque limits, something like that. Um, but Burger Motorsports have just released their JB4 tuning box and they've sent us one down to test it. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. So we're gonna be removing the race chip, installing the JB4, we're gonna be testing it on the dyno to see what power output it makes standard and then compare it once we've installed some of the JB4 tuning maps. Okay, so we just finished off Dino in the Market Golf R and we've got some graphs behind us to talk to you about. So um, the blue lines that you can see are the car with a inventory intake with standard mapping and then the red lines is with the JB4 and obviously the inventory intake. Um, we did have some um, greater gains than what you can see behind us. However, um, the graph was a little bit bumpy and it's probably not going to be very nice to drive. So we sort of settled with this uh, red line that you can see here. Um, so just to discuss some of the power, so standard, the car was about 349 horsepower and about 448 new meters of torque. And then with the JB4, I believe this was map four um, on this car, we're running around 359 horsepower and then 489 new meters of torque. So around a 10 horsepower gain at peak and about 40 new meter gain at peak as well. However, as always, that's only sort of like half the story. So you can see some really good gains here, which is the torque and then here, which is the power as well. So you're gaining um, around sort of like 40, 50 foot pounds of torque in the sort of like early mid range. And then the same with the horsepower as well. So you're seeing around sort of like 20, 30 horsepower gain um, the low to mid range as well. So really, really good gains in this tuner box. Um, you can actually custom tune with the JB4. Um, so we're just gonna figure out that out because we haven't done it before. And maybe we'll revisit this video if we can access some of the higher maps um, with some smoother graphs because it was actually making around 369 horsepower and just over 500 newton meters of torque. But like I say, the graphs weren't particularly smooth and it's something we wanna obviously work with uh, Burger Motorsports on and see if we can get that graph nice and smooth. So 
yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, let us know what you think in the comments. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then please give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to watch other videos of ours that YouTube thinks you'll like, then click up here. If you'd like to watch some other videos that we have in the same playlist, then click here. And obviously, if you enjoyed the video, then we really appreciate if you gave us a subscription. Um, and then obviously, you'll be updated when other videos of ours go live. And you can do that quite easily by clicking here. Hope to see you soon.